Hey there everybody, this is Rina and I'm back! So, I'm going to do a makeup tutorial with my very first MAC lipstick which was given to me by my boyfriend so thank you and it's a very challenging shade for me because I don't usually do this kind of shade hope you guys enjoy watching this video and subscribe to my channel if you're new here and let's do this! and the first thing we're going to do is to moisturize our face or use any kind of skincare you have so I'm using Celetec hydration guys i advise you to use this if you have a very dry skin because i promise you with everything i don't have <laughs> uh, that this is really effective next thing that we're going to use is my primer from maybelline and this is a baby skin this has been my primer for years and since nagtitipid ako so T zone area ko lang siya nilalagay. But if you have plenty of the product and plenty of gong to buy primers, you can go ahead and put it all over your face. Next up is LA Girls Pro Conceal in Green Corrector. So this enables to cancel out all the red tones on your face. So mine, yan yung mga sa tinuro ko, yun yung may mga red ako. So there you have it. So next, we're going to blend it with a sponge. So mine's from Nichido Foundation Sponge. So if you have a beauty blender, maybe much better. Pero wala din naman yan sa tools. Nasa sa tao yan kung gano'n ka, 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 ka talented sa pag make up. So yan, blend, blend, blend. All the things you put on your face. Beat your face. So there it is when it's blended. So we're going to move on with foundation. So I'm using Revlon Color Stay in the shade Sand Beige. So advice ko lang sa inyo guys na pag nilagay nyo na siyang ganyan sa face nyo, right after nyo maglagay, i-blend nyo agad. Kasi kung hindi, magstay siya sa face mo. As in, babakat na lang siya doon, ang hirap na niyang i-blend. Blend na agad tayo after maglagay. So next is concealer from NYX in the shade beige. So since I have yellow tone tones. <laughs> So, yun, puro yellow undertones yung ginagamit kong products. And you have to put it at the places na gusto mong i-conceal. There it is. And then, we're going to use my brow pomade, which is from BYS. And it's in the shade Natural Brown. And first thing you gotta do is to brush your eyebrow hair up. Then fill everything in with your eyebrow brush. So the trick here is, para hindi maging masyadong matapang yung look mo, yung mga tira-tira nung sa product mo after putting it on the outside part of your eyebrows. Yung natirang product ilalagay mo siya dun sa inner corner of your eyebrows. So, yun yung key para hindi maging mukhang harsh and mukhang drawn, drawn in yung eyebrows mo. Then, after filling it in, you have to blend it. Kasi, you don't want nga to make it look too drawn. So next is my LA Pro Conceal in the shade Porcelain, which is not really my shade, kaya bumili ko ng ibang concealer. So I used this as a eyeshadow primer, since wala akong ganun. This is a perfect substitute. So don't mind my Barbie head, 
the side with a head massager. <laughs> and my camera is already falling to the side. Kasi cellphone lang to. Nalobat yung camera ko. Agad. When I was filming my intro. So, yan. Ayusin ko naman siya mga bes. Wait lang. Then, it syempre. Ako, I'm using my foundation brush. Kasi, wala naman ako ibang brush. Unti lang brush ko, guys. Tipid nga ang lola nyo, eh. Next is, we're going to set it with a powder. So, I'm using Creme, Max Factor's Creme Puff in the shade Golden. My mama entered the room and she saw me doing this and she's weirded out. Because she's listening to my yummy taste. Whoops! She, did, she didn't know I was filming. Obvious naman, diba? So, we're going to use my H&M palette in the... And it's called Smoky Essentials. So, I used the white shade there to set it. And I'm using the NYX Dream Catcher palette in the Golden Horizons. And I'm used the light brown shade as my tr transition shade and the darker shade there and the even darker shade in my H&M palette and use it as a contour for the crease and put it in the outer corners as well so kaya ako may tape sa gilid kasi I want everything to be perfect kaya I want that perfect wing So guys, don't forget to blend everything. And here, I'm using my white eyeshadow to make the next eyeshadow that I'm going to use to pop. Whoops, boing. <laughs> so next is, we're going to use that black eyeshadow from the H&M palette. And just smoke out the outer corners of my eyes. And I'm using a blending brush from Marionauts. Ooh, next, the shade that I don't use too much. Orange. Ooh, yeah. I was really curious to use this color. And in this video, it's not halata, but in person it is. So my light's really harsh. Pala. So I have to do something with that. And yan, lagay lang natin yung eyeshadow sa inner corners and in the middle part so it's a shimmery orange eyeshadow and I was really curious to try it that's why I did this and even another orange colored eyeshadow for the inner corners of my eyes so there the finish na yung ating eyeshadows and I already did my eyeliner So yeah, my eyelash curler ako, false eyelashes, but I didn't have the glue, so I didn't put it on na, na din. Kasi wala din akong tweezers, hindi ako magaling mag false eyelashes, sorry na. So yeah, nag mascara na lang ako. And I'm using Max Factor's Clump Defy Mascara. But I don't like the smell of this, but it's good, so taste ganda. Pitek kung pitek, friend. Diba? Oh, huh? So next, we're going to move on with the lips. So ito na. Woo. I'm using the pinky in the shade brown. And mahirap maglagay ng, eyeline, ng lip liner pag putol. So yan. Hindi ko na kasi siya nagagamit since I don't have brown shades of lipsticks. And tong ang lipstick na to is a brown shade. So the struggle is real here. Oh, huh? <laughs> so there's the finished product from the lip liner. And here's the MAC lipstick. And it's in the shade Antique Velvet. Whoop! It's a dark brown color. And I told you 
hindi ako naggagantong shade. But, I accept the challenge. Yan. It just really needs to be balanced with the eyes. Kasi kung hindi, medyo magara siyang tignan pag wala kang eye makeup. So, ayan. Ginawa ng tutorial ng ate nyo. Dahil, gusto rin ipakita sa jowa niya na kinagamit yung lipstick na bigay niya. ba? Diba? comment down below of what you think about this and leave me requests of makeup looks that you want me to do yeah that's what I want to say so like this video if you are going to relate to what I'm going to say na you're doing makeup or you're practicing your makeup and then you're going to remove it afterwards kasi wala ka naman dapat puntahan tapos matutulog ka lang naman kaya sabi nila sayang yung makeup pero masayang naman din kapag hindi mo naman ginagamit yung makeup kasi mag-expire lang siya so that's wrap. Oh, that's a wrap. <laughs> so guys, if you want to subscribe and see more of my videos and covers and other video makeup tutorials, so don't forget to subscribe in my video and I <laughs> don't forget to subscribe in my channel. Goodbye and bye bye. Yeah.